Welcome to the Pico Plus calibration video. In this video we will show you how to calibrate the Pico Plus smokerizer correctly. The instruments are always calibrated before leaving bed front. However, to ensure that it is ready for use and that you are familiar with the unit, it is recommended that you calibrate it upon receiving the monitor. Bedfront Scientific can supply everything you need for calibrating the Pico Plus in a handy kit. It is strongly advised that you use Bedfront's calibration kit as using other alternatives can damage the unit or create false readings. Please ring Bedfront or your local distributor to obtain one. In this kit you will find a fine control valve, a flow indicator, a calibration adapter and tubing, a 20 ppm CO in air gas cylinder. You will also require your supplied D piece. Please do this process in a well ventilated area as carbon monoxide is a harmful gas. Connect the fine control valve and the flow indicator to the calibration adapter as shown. Place the calibration adapter into a D-piece. Ensure that the fine control valve is in the off position before threading it onto the gas canister. Next, screw the fine control valve and flow indicator assembly onto the gas canister ensuring not to cross the thread. It is recommended that you hold the canister and fine control valve as shown here. The monitor will remind the user that it needs to be calibrated every six months. If your monitor is due its six month calibration, it will display as shown here. Double click the tick indicated on the screen of the Pico Plus by pressing the blue button twice. If you are manually calibrating the Pico Plus, you will find the calibration settings by scrolling down to the cylinder icon by single pressing the blue button and selecting it with a double press. Double click the cylinder icon on the Pico Plus by pressing the blue button twice and connect the D piece to the Pico Plus. Immediately open the fine control valve like so and allow the gas to flow at 1 litre per minute. This is maintained by observing the ball in the flow indicator and adjusting accordingly as seen here. Allow the gas to flow through the instrument for approximately one and a half minutes. Remember to keep a close eye on the flow rate and adjust accordingly. You will notice the values climbing on the display of the monitor. Once the value has ceased to increase or one and a half minutes has been reached, the final measured value will be shown and sampling will cease. If the displayed reading is within 5 and 40 ppm, it will automatically set to 20 ppm and will ask you to confirm by a tick. It is very important to confirm the calibration at this stage with a double click in order to save the calibration. Turn off the gas flow and remove the DP sampling system. Your Pico Plus is now ready for use. If the calibration fails, a cross will appear. Please check the gas has not run out or is switched off. Double click the button to try again. The Pico Plus will allow you to try three times. If all fail, the following icon will appear. Please contact Bedfont or your local distributor if you see this icon.